This is a call out for help. Um, for those who don't know me, <clears throat> I'm Keely Ann of the Baker family. I've been on the street from the start of all this, but uh, obviously my voice wasn't to be heard. I've had many arrests due to all this coronavirus uh, regulations, and I've been standing up in my right for everybody, not for myself, for everybody. This is not selfish reasons why I do this. I have done all the lawful notices myself. I have represented myself in court. Um, on the 11th of August, they found me guilty in my absence without the evidence that I relied on to prove my innocence. The police are withholding a phone which holds the video of the events that happened that day on the 23rd of March. Without this evidence, I cannot prove my innocence. So I am trying to get this heard in the High Court and I'm doing everything I can with the administration to the best of my knowledge. There's a live warrant and has been since the 11th of August. Through this unsafe conviction, my dad passed away the 20th of August. I was unable to attend the funeral. They had plain clothes CID officers waiting for me. Now the embarrassment of being arrested at my dad's funeral and not being able to say goodbye would have been devastating. I am preserving my liberty in order to fight for my freedoms. Without my freedom, I cannot fight for my liberty. Now, <clears throat> I feel like I've covered all angles with the courts to put in my notices and say that I have been wronged in law. I am fully willing to go into that court myself and stand in my right. But as it stands, I am being told because I am litigant in person that there are, there are things that are going on behind the scene that I cannot deal with and I know nothing about. Now this is underhanded, this is not the process of law. I do not speak legalese, I speak plain English. So I need your help guys. As of the 11th of August, I have been preserving my liberty. I've been staying from place to place while doing this administration the best I can. I couldn't say goodbye to my dad. I'm actually 39 years old tomorrow and I'm gonna spend that birthday without, without my loved ones. Due to this unsafe conviction and warrant, they are trying everything they can to try and bury this. I have a civil claim in um, against the courts for a misadministration of justice and uh, that was issued on the 28th of June and uh, still no no hearing of any court case being being brought to the surface in this particular claim it states all the events that have happened and the fact that I need this phone that the police are still withholding to prove my innocence so I need your support guys I need a good lawyer or a good solicitor who can help me and I need some financial support. I'm having to pay from place to place without being able to go home and uh, it is, it's, becoming, it's becoming tiring. They have tried to say that I I'm mentally unstable, that I voice suicidal thoughts, which is false information. I did not say this. I'm rebutting their accusations and uh, hopefully that is now, that matter is now going to be drawn to a close because uh, I can prove that I did not say this. But the tactics they are using are very dirty. And... Um, <clears throat> we're now in November I don't know how long this is going to go on for guys but I can tell you now that I will be taking this as far as I can I'm doing this for every man, woman and child I've done nothing wrong and we deserve freedom so as much as there has been so many people 
asking for money and that is nothing that has never been something that I wanted to do all these crowd funds I mean I I was with Stand Up X got kicked out of Stand Up X I was campaigning with Piers Corbyn his solicitor didn't want to help so all these crowdfundings and people asking for money has been something that I did not I did not want to follow that path you know I thought I could do this myself but I've come to a brick wall and I need support guys uh, so with your support there's going to be a, a, a sort of funding set up to try and help to get somebody to help me in, in, the, in this high court case that I'm trying to pursue because I feel that the way they are treating me as the litigant in person that um, I'm not going to get any access to justice at the moment um, guys I need help uh, I stand under the creator.